Hey, what's up guys? So today I have a video on execution and recognition of the GPERMs. The execution really isn't very hard, but recognizing the GPERMs can be quite tricky because they all have a set of headlights and a 1x2 bar. So hopefully you will learn and get tips and tricks on how to recognize the GPERMs and execute them in this video. So the first G perm I'm showing you guys is the GB perm, and in my opinion, it's the easiest one because the bar is in the F face, and it's the only algorithm that uses the F face. So if you're, you're holding the cube in the correct orientation, the bar will be in the F face and the headlights will be in the back. For the rest of the algorithms, the headlights will be on the left side, and for this GD perm, you will have the bar be in the front face and the execution from there is pretty simple. There's two ways that I execute the GD perm. The first one didn't require any rotations and but you use the F face. For this one you will notice a difference in the ending where I will do a rotation and then use the left side. Here's just a side-by-side -side comparison of them and you will it's just simple differences and you will find which one you find to be more comfortable when executing. I tend to use both. For the GCG perm, the headlights will be on the left at still and when you look to the front and to the right you will notice that there is no pair so you automatically know that the pair is in the back Therefore, the execution and recognition of this GPERM should be pretty simple. Lastly, the GA perm, you will notice that the bar is in the front, but you hold it so that it's at the right, and it's the only algorithm that requires a RUR prime trigger and then a rotation. So that is all for my video on how to execute and recognize the GPERMs. If you have any questions, feel free to leave it in the comment section. And if you guys use any other algorithms that you think I might want to know, also leave that in the comment section. And that is all for this video. I will see you guys next time. Bye.